hey Maddie, and other non-Maddie people. So, I've been thinking a lot about why people should listen to classical music and go to classical music concerts and such. This is mostly to do with the fact that Oberlin, the college I go to, has a conservatory, um, and so there's a lot of student concerts, and in fact, I just got back from one of them, so, um, pamphlet, yeah. And I've been going to rather a lot of them, to be very honest with you. It's one of the few things in college that I'm very happy about. Um, these are all of my pamphlets, or, like, programs, rather, that I, from, yeah, things that I've gone to so far this semester. So, there'll be plenty more to come, but, um, I thought I would say, before going to college, I never really went to a classical music concert. Like, even, like, the high school orchestra, I didn't really go to their concerts, even though I knew people in them. Um, and so I decided when I met, uh, one of my friends at Oberlin who is a bassoonist, and she said, oh, let's, I'm gonna go to this concert, Ron, come with me. I was like, why the hell not? I'm in college, let's go crazy, let's see some classical music. Um, and the concerts are mostly free because they're mostly just students playing pieces for their, uh, orchestras and whatnot. And so, we just sort of, like, went. And, like, I've learned over, like, my, my long career, or, like, the many concerts that I've been to, that either you connect with a piece to where you pay attention to the extent that you're not bored, and so that, like, you feel when the it rises and then it falls and you get really into it. So either it's that kind of piece, which is really nice and fulfilling, and so you spend, like, an hour and a half to two hours feeling, like, into it and, like, out of body, sort of. Or you don't really like a piece and you're a little bit bored, but then you can just sit there and, like, think. Like, that's one of my favorite things to do is, like, if I could do it in my bed, I would, but I just end up falling asleep where you can just sit somewhere not do anything and think about the things that you've been not thinking about for a while. Like, a few concerts ago I was planning my novel for National Novel Writing Month, like, during the concert, and like, this time I was thinking about my winter term project a little bit during the beginning pieces because I wasn't a huge fan, and I mean, if you get bored, just like, look at specific people playing and like, just see how into it they are. And it's awesome when you see people do something that they're passionate about. I'm just concerned because I know people who are playing, like, who want to be professionals in a sort of dying field of classical music. Um, and that concerns me. So I think that everyone should go see more classical music concerts. Um, including you, Maddie. I don't know what your background is with those, but they're fun. And... I don't know, I, I always feel like it's like almost meditation for me, either I'm out of my body or I'm so in it that it's like me just thinking. And I wish that my parents had taken me to more classical music concerts when I was little. Alright Maddie, um, I'll be seeing you in a week and a bit. It's finals right now, so I had my last day of like normal classes today. And it was 12 degrees outside in the morning. And so, this week's gonna be awful. <laughs> Bye.